Okay, so on July 2015, it's base month. Uh, the table shows index numbers for the consumer price index in 2015 to 2017. Mm -hmm. Given an interpretation of 103.2 in the table. So um, don't do anything flash. 103.2 just means 3.2% increase from 2015. Okay. Uh, CPI is a weighted index. It measures the changes in the prices of consumer goods and services only on the weightings are shown on the table below. Using July 15 as a base month, the index number for goods is 2017 was 100.7. Calculate the index number for services in July 2017. Now, what you've got to understand, really, is that um, this one at the top, this original index number, that's an average of your goods and your services. So you need to try and remember how to do your weighted average. Yeah. Now, your weighted average would be um, get your weight, which is 525, yeah, times the actual number. And for goods, we've got 107, so 100.7. Yeah. And then we're going to do the other weighted, which is 475 times... And that's what it's asking for. So I'm going to call this X. Okay. Uh, let's put some brackets in. Not that you need it, but it just makes you understand what's going on. And that's got to be over the total weighting, which is 525 plus 475. Okay. And all of this is going to equal 103.2. Because that's my actual weighted average at the top there. And all we have to do now is solve it. So I'm, I'm going to times both sides by 525 plus 475. So times both by 1,000. Okay. 103.2, okay, which gives me 103.200, and then uh, I've got 525 times 100.7, so I'm going to change that to 52867.5 plus 475x, so I'm going to minus uh, both sides by 52,876. Uh, 103,200, which gives me 5033.2.5 equals 475x. Mm. And we'll divide both sides by 475, which gives me the answer of 105.96. Okay, right. Let's see. One of the items included in the good index is food. Assess whether or not it is appropriate to use 100.7 in order to find the estimate of the change in price from food from 2015 to 2017. And uh, this is not appropriate, really, because we don't have enough data, and we know that because it's a combination of those two, those weightings might change, so we can't make any assumptions.